and what better way to end 2017 with my last winner's fab finds video. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today is the very last video that I will do for 2017. Like, whoa, like, exciting. <laughs> so what better way to do it than do a winner's fab find. A lot of you guys like these videos and I love these videos to be quite honest because I love finding certain brands that are like way cheaper to buy at winners than they are to actually buy in the store. So if you guys like videos like this, don't forget to go ahead and click that subscribe button. And yeah, you still have time to enter into my Christmas giveaway. The link is right here. So good luck to everybody that enters. With all that being said, let's jump in to see what I found. So if you guys remembered from my other winner's fab finds that I did find the Venus palette one. Well, you'll never guess what I found in my travels this time. I did find the Lime Crime Venus Palette 2, and I did pay $24.99 for it. And I was like, yes, I'm super, super excited that I found this because this is the one that I wanted for my stuff. The other one was a gift. So I was like, yay. And it's just so, so stunning. I'm going to take off that little tiny film that's on top of it. And here are the shades here. Just look how pretty they are. So, so gorgeous. Really, really love it. Just so eye-catching. And I know that I've said in the past that I'm really not one for blue eyeshadows, but this one really caught my eye. It's just a really nice soft blue. It's not like, you know, really bold blue. So I really can't wait to play with this palette. What I'm actually going to do is I'm gonna have a video coming up soon testing out products that I found at Winners. So we're gonna do a whole like swatch and try on and see how well that goes. So if you guys see these palettes at your local Winners, definitely pick them up, $24.99 compared to $42. That is an awesome deal. And this next one here is by Vegas Nay. Now I did purchase two Vegas Nay products in my other Winners Fab Finds and I have not stopped using them. I am obsessed, obsessed, obsessed. Like I cannot stress that enough how beautiful all the products are from the eyeshadows to the matte lip cream. Love, love, love. So when I've been wearing that matte lip cream, not today though, but when I've been wearing it, I've been wearing it all of December and I just can't get enough of it. I just love it. So when I seen this lip set into Winners, and I only paid $8.99 for it, so that's a great deal. And it comes in this beautiful case, really fancy looking. And I was like, okay, I'm definitely purchasing it. And it comes with the lip liner, and you have a matte lip cream, and then you have a crystal shine lip cream as well. And I thought the box was really pretty. And look at this. Oh, I did feel this. Behind this, there is a mirror. Don't want to blind you guys, so I'm going to put it down like this. And then it just closes up like that. How cute is that? I love it. So I am going to be trying these out. But the Vintage Maroon, I think it's called, the one that I always wear, I'm obsessed. I'm going to pop up a picture of me wearing it. Obsessed. Like I said, it's just so gorgeous. Glides on really nice and easy. Really comfortable to the lips. And the wear time is amazing. I, I wore it like from eight in the morning till five in the evening. I only had to touch up once. Like, and that was very little, like very little touch up, like just in the center of my lip, a little tiny bit. Other than that, amazing. So if you guys see these lip sets into winners, for sure pick them up because you will not be disappointed. Now, I don't know what the crystal lip shine is like. I haven't tested that out yet, so I don't know. But for the matte lip creams, spot on, beautiful. And of course, I found some awesome brushes and I was really excited for this because I do like LA Girl products, like certain products I do like by them. But when I seen these brushes, I was like, oh yes, let's pick them up. These are the LA Girl Pro brushes. This one here is brush number 107 and it's a blush brush. I paid $8.99 for this one here. And it's so beautiful, the black with the gold, really nice. I haven't tested these out yet, so I don't know how well and how soft the brushes are. Then I picked up the fan brush and this is 102 and it was $7.99. Then I picked up the smudge brush. This one here was only $4.99. Then I picked up the blending brush and that was $5.99. 
I also have a shadow brush that I picked up that was only $4.99. I don't know where it's gone. That's really sad. But hopefully I'll be able to find it. So I'm going to put these to the test. When I was at Winners the other day down in the East End, if you live in the St. John's area, they had a bunch of these. They also had a bunch of Sigma brushes as well. So if you're on the hunt for the LA Girl Pro brushes or also the Sigma brushes, definitely check it out. Now, I've never ever tried LA Colors before, but when I seen this palette, I was like, oh my goodness, so, so pretty. I'm actually gonna tear off the seal so I can show you guys the shades in this palette. And it is the Sweet 16 Color Eyeshadows. And it almost reminded me of the Modern Renaissance, and I only paid $7.99 for it. So there's the price right there, $7.99. And really nice packaging. I really like the packaging. I just think, you know, for something that's $7.99, that's pretty nice packaging. And here are the shades here. Yes, definitely reminds me of Modern Renaissance kind of vibes on the go here, for sure. Like Love Letter, Cypress Umber, um, even Bon Frisco, like this shade here almost reminds me of Bon Frisco as well. I'm actually going to do a video for you guys because a lot of you guys have been asking for half drugstore, half high-end um, face makeup. So I'm going to put those to the test and see if you guys could actually tell the difference from high end to low end, and I'm even gonna use the Modern Renaissance palette. I might put it up against the LA Girls, uh, co not LA Girls, LA Color. LA Girls, LA Color, <sighs> gets me all mixed up. <laughs> so this next set here, I'm super excited to see because we don't have MAC Cosmetics here at all, so I have to order it online, or if I see it at Winners and it catches my eye, I'm like, yes, please. <laughs> and this is the MAC Very Valuable Retro Matte Liquid Lip Color Kit two. That is a mouthful. But with all that being said, I only paid $24.99. And I'm going to show you the shades here. So the first shade here we have is Flesh Stone. It's beautiful. I'm so gorgeous. So, so gorgeous. I was about to say, I'm so gorgeous. No, this is so gorgeous. <laughs> and the next shade here I got is To Matte With Love. And then Divine Divine. So, so pretty. I love, love the packaging. And the great thing was that these were in a protective case, so I know they weren't swatched at all. Because, you know, when you go down winners, sometimes a lot of stuff is swatched, and you're just like, hell no. This next item that I seen, I was like, okay, let's pick this up, because I was like, that looks like a really good deal. And I only paid $19.99, and it's six beauty sponges. I haven't tested them out yet, but I thought, what a little great idea. Like, Let's put a whole bunch of sponges in this jar and it'll just hold them really nice. I am going to test them out so I will let you guys know what they're like. If you guys have tried like Winner's Beauty sponges before, let me know in the comments down below and what you think of them. But I thought for six of them for $19.99, that was an awesome deal and a cute little container too. So this next product myself and my mother picked up, my mom's like, look at this. I was like, oh wow, they look really interesting. And it's called True Beauty Silver Foil Face Mask and it's brightening and vitamin C. You're getting a total of five masks in here for $9.99. It says that it's safe for all skin types. One size fits all. I've never seen that before about a face mask. One size fits all. It's very interesting. So I'm gonna put these to the test and see what they're like. If you guys would like to see a video on these, let me know in the comments down below. Maybe I'll go out and pick up a different face mask and put them to the test and compare them to like say Sephora mask and see how well they work. But I thought this was pretty interesting. So these next few products that I'm going to be showing you are by Profusion. And I've seen them pop up, people doing videos here on YouTube. And I was like, oh my goodness, I really want to get my hands on those palettes. But I didn't find them. I found a few, but none that I've seen yet online. So I'm really curious to see how well they work. And this one here that I found is the Natural Tin Eye Color Eyeshadow Palette. And this here was only $9.99, which was a great deal for 10 eyeshadows. And just look at the shades in here. It does remind me of like the Urban Decay Naked One Palette, maybe. And then it comes with a brush. Now, the Naked 1 palette I don't have. I had the Naked 2 and 3. 
So I'm really curious to see how well these shadows play up. Um, but like I've said, I've seen a lot of reviews on other palettes by Profusion and people are raving about the pigmentation, the quality of the shadows. So I'm really curious to put this to the test. And the next two products that I found are by Profusion as well. When I see these, they really caught my eye because they look like a chocolate bar. <laughs> this one here is the eyeshadow highlight and blush palette. I only paid $9.99 for it and also came with a brush. And this one here is the bronze and illuminator palette and a setting blush for $9.99 and also came with a brush as well. I'm going to open up these and just show you guys what they look like. So here is the eyeshadow palette does remind me, I do believe it's Makeup Revolution that has like the chocolate bar on it, but this is like a raised one and it's like really nice and rubbery. Really nice packaging, I have to say. Let's open it up and see what it looks like, shall we? So here we go, we've got a nice size mirror which I'm going to cover it up. Here are the shadows here. Really, really pretty. Let's just swap. Oh! Holy Toledo, look at that. Oh my goodness, that is gorgeous. Like, that is like butter. Here we go, here's the yellow shade. Oh my God, when I swatch that, that is just like pure, pure butter. So, so beautiful, exciting to do a look with this for sure. And here is the little bronze palette. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, this has a nice size mirror as well. It got a funny smell to it. I never smelled the eyeshadow palette, but oh my goodness, super smooth as well. Wow, that's like super, super pigmented. Really, really nice. That's super impressive. The brushes are really nice and soft as well, so I will be putting them to the test to see how well they work. So you guys, this is it. This is my last video for 2017. I really hope you guys enjoyed all my videos this year and I hope you guys enjoyed my winner's fab finds. Let me know in the comments down below what winner fab finds you guys find. You always know, I'd love to hear from you guys. And yeah, don't forget to enter in my Christmas giveaway. We are almost to the end to it. Good luck to everybody that enters. And I hope you all have a fantastic holiday season. I love each and every one of you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the new year. Bye.